We have the Guilford. This is the postal trucks, and they're all the way around Gay Avenue. This is how much of a postal backup you got in Baltimore. We feeding the homeless today. Oh, shit. They down here already. Oh, well, ain't no sense in trucks coming down here. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? What's up, what's up, what's up? How y'all doing? What's up, what's, what's up, baby? How y'all doing, Santa Claus? We don't want no trouble, man. We don't want no trouble? Huh, that's Donald Trump in there. <laughs> hey, I'm down, hey. I'm down under 83. I'm down under the 80, we barbecuing. All right? I'm down under 83 underneath the, no, I got fresh everything over there. All right, tell everybody around there, too. What? What? Oh, man, I gotta get a video of that Donald Trump. Why? Right, you gotta get a video of Donald Trump. Slow down, Santa Claus. What's up, man? We feeding under 83, too. We got barbecue. Yeah. With us encampment at. We got barbecue and everything. Look for that big black grill. I'm gonna leave it down there. I know what you're talking about. Santa Claus. Open up the door. Open the door. Oh, shit. Let me pull over. Pull over. Let me pull over. <laughs> Just us feeding the homeless down here. What's up, baby? How you feel? All right. I see, I see, the, I see the Donald Trump. Donald Trump. Donald Trump. I bring him to the hood. What's up, young young? What's up? What's up? I bring him to the hood. I bring him to the hood. Donald Trump in the hood. <laughs> hey, we feeding under 83. We got barbecue and all that. Y'all go up under there. Y'all can eat real good. If y'all ain't eat already, y'all can take as much as you want. All right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know, you got hand me up. You're going to give me them clothes next year. I'll be, you be bigger than me. Yeah, you be, I'll be wearing your shit next year. <laughs> That's Santa Claus. Santa Claus, what you got to say about Donald Trump? Do we get a piece of coal or what? Fuck Trump. <laughs> that's Santa Claus talking about fuck Trump. That's real political right there. But oh, you say listen, to, listen to this. Fuck you, Trump. Fuck you. We got the people over here. We sick. We got the Ching Chong virus. Fuck you, Trump. Fuck you. <laughs> Hey, man. Real quick, tell the people what you doing, man. All right, I'm a, I'm an advocate. I'm not a terrorist. I, I'm, 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 I'm uh, ignorantly intelligent. I brought Donald Trump to Baltimore because Donald Trump already talking about Baltimore. And now Baltimore get to talk back. Y'all bring clack clack down here in that red dress. Send her back. Pimping ain't easy. Donald Trump paid for that. Ain't no black people gave her no money. You feel me? White people gave her money to come here and talk about Baltimore. They call that Jim Crow, the new face of Willie Lynch. Education instead of incarceration. Learn something from him, like me. Let's go, you, you, you feel me? Big, bro. All right. All right. Holidays. Happy holidays, Santa Claus. You already know what it is. All right. Yeah. Donald Trump, you got something to say? <laughs> you got something to say? You can say anything. But this is homelessness in Baltimore, right here at the church. You feel me? Y'all locked and padlocked the church, so the homeless can't be there. But they right outside on your front door steps. Brandon Scott, Nick Mosby, y'all been in the office since I've been since I've been uh, homeless. Y'all ain't did nothing in the homeless community, and y'all keep robbing Baltimore. Brandon Scott, man, tell the truth and shame the devil. Start taking care of those less fortunate. Do your job, or lose your job, because I'm deep in these streets. Everybody know me. In 2020, we gonna have a garbage strike. I'm getting ready to show you Baltimore. Y'all shut the shot tower down. Y'all shut the shot tower down so I can't feed at the shot tower. Y'all shut this down so I can't feed there. You feel me? Homelessness in Baltimore, y'all trying to hide it. And y'all spending a lot of money on tourism. I gave Chief Harrison evidence to send Brandon Scott to jail over six months over a year ago. But y'all don't want to investigate the corruption here in Baltimore. Y'all protect y'all's corruption with your police department. I'm a prisoner's right advocate. I'm a homeless advocate. You can go get your first story on me from Richard Sher. You feel me? I'm about that life. I ain't about that bullshit. I'm an activist. I'm not an actorvist.
I do this because it needs to be done. I don't do it for money. I don't do it for fame. I do it because it needs to be done. Now here is your Baltimore. This is St. Vincent de Paul. This is your homeless community. You feel me? And these is the trucks waiting to get into the post office. These is the trucks waiting to get into the post office. And right there is your homeless community, right there with the tents. Right here across the street. You feel me? This is homelessness in Baltimore. Y'all evicted the homeless from right there. Y'all evicted them from right there. Like I said, this is Baltimore. There go homelessness right there. See the tents? Motherfucker just had to take a piss and the shit. You feel me? This is homelessness in Baltimore. You just closed the homeless center right here. This center been closed for over six months. You could have turned this and, and flipped this and made it habitable. You, the city owns this property. They also own Central Booking. It's a downtown mayor club and that's what we feed in the day. Brandon Scott, Nick Mosby. Y'all just gave Nick Mosby $750,000 for four years. Seven times four is $2.8 million. $2.8 million. And you can't do nothing for the homeless people. Jack made sure that Nick Mosby get $2.8 million. $750,000 for four years for the city council president. Y'all stealing in front of your face. This is the homeless center in Baltimore. And y'all got it closed up. You got it boarded up. The lights is on. Electric bill getting paid. But ain't nobody here. You criminalizing poverty. Because here goes central booking and y'all filled up. Y'all filled up at central booking. You paying attention to this? This is what you talked about, Baltimore. Well, this is part of Baltimore. This is part of Baltimore. Central booking, asbestos and lead, health risks, health hazards, homelessness right here. Right here on Guilford Avenue. You see the smoke? That may, that's where I'm at. See it right here? See where we at? Right under 83. See all the garbage the city won't come pick up? You feel me? You trying to leave this garbage down here so these people will be infested with other things. You got rats down here. You got pigeons down here. This is the homeless encampment down here. That's the Baltimore Sun. If the Baltimore Sun got all that building, why is these people so homeless? Crime and justice, and it's just us. I 
I'm going to show you what homelessness looks like in Baltimore. Baltimore, Chicago, Los Angeles, because you don't want to do the right thing. For four years, you forgot about the underclass. The last shall be first and the first shall be last for all you Christian individuals. You feel me? Uh, and this is, this is it. That's me, Shorty's Bootleg Barbecue. They say bring your masses, bring your masses. This is where y'all should come down to take care of the homeless people, because this is where it's at. This is where it's at. Right here. And we're getting ready to feed them. This grill feeds Baltimore. Never bite the hand that feeds you. Feel me? Miss Flowers, anything you want to say? Help! 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 Hey, tell them, tell them. Yeah, we laugh. Help! What's up? See that? Hey. I... <laughs> he stuck his knife in my back already. He already got me. God damn. It wasn't me, cuz. It wasn't me. Damn. Yeah, he just like Jesus. Like hey, check this out. Tell Brandon Scott to get somebody to come get this garbage. Tell your message, because yes, this is your please, thing. Please, can y'all call 311? We have been, like, assisting and paying for people to come take out trash. So we made a decision to put all the trash on tier five at the bottom of the encampment. To keep the rats so out of to here. To keep the rats away from us. So can we please... Um, have Brandon to send the city up here with the dump truck and help us to manage our trash and things of that If nature. Brandon don't come get this trash, I'm going to take it to City Hall. Well, we can take it to City Hall, too. All right. We need help, y'all. We need a want and listen. Stop. Don't believe the hype, okay? Stop believing the hype. You can't come and take one homeless person, two homeless person, when you feel like you're ready to. And we got 22 individuals down here that needs to go at one time. We got cold blue 20 feet away that's empty. Our schools, whatever they can do. Don't believe the hype that people not, oh, what they say? People not accepting services. People don't want to go into shelters. If you look at the history of Baltimore City shelters, you know, the environment itself, itself is enough to keep them out of here. So don't believe. They're sending the health people down there. They're sending the health department down there to do any testing. Uh, Have they? No. No COVID testing. No COVID testing either. No health, no, no health, nothing. No testing, no PPE, no porta potties. All the city sent us is one bag of food a day. One bag of food. One bag of food. Are you going to use this? I'm going to take all the bags. All right. This is the contribution from the people pulling together. All right. What's your Christmas look like? Because this is what Christmas looked like in Baltimore for the homeless community. This is what Christmas looked like for the homeless community. Right here. So what part are you going to play in this? All right. Because we doing it. Been doing it. All right. Right here. This is the community grill. This is Big Gaddy on Wheels. And this is the wood that we use in the hood. You feel me? Never bite the hand that feeds you. Never bite the hand that feeds you. And I feed Baltimore. So Brandon Scott, Nick Mosby, 2021 session, y'all need to start being accountable for this money y'all been stealing from the homeless community and what you stole from me. This ain't my fight, this our struggle. This is Baltimore, live.